Off-road vehicle designers from Strats Incorporated are working with Command Joint Task Force Kurhi soldiers in Afghanistan to evaluate a new military vehicle. The Enhanced Logistics Support Off-Road Vehicle, or LSORB, gives soldiers the ability to medevac and resupply troops in remote areas. Uh, it gives them the opportunity to uh, get to the top of ridge lines, uh, to go down through wadis, uh, to avoid the roads, uh, uh, and do an unanticipated approach. We've come up with this design uh, from back home. We do a lot of off-roading. We've uh, got a lot of off-road background where we've built some of the vehicles for ourselves plus uh, customers. A modified Humvee engine powers the LSORB, enabling it to reach speeds in excess of 90 miles per hour. It has a 90 degree approach angle and can traverse slopes in excess of 80 degrees without rollover. The LSORB's interior provides soldiers with adequate space for personnel, gear, and room to support a medevac. The Army Rapid Equipping Force depends on soldier feedback to evaluate new equipment. A real soldier is the one that's going to use them the most. It's it just seems practical that they put actual soldiers in the vehicle to see what they're comfortable with, see what changes that could possibly be made. Uh, they really like the vehicles, and uh, they're giving us some really good feedback as, some of the, uh, as far as some of the other things they would like to see on the vehicle. These LSORs are a uh, blast to drive. It's uh, not like any other military vehicle I've ever driven. It goes wherever you want it to go, point it, and pretty much go. There are only four LSOR vehicles in existence today. But depending on the training and evaluations here, the LSORB may be coming to a combat theater near you. Reporting from Bob Salerno, Afghanistan, I'm Army Sergeant Bill Valentine.